Woody Williams is on the minds of many tonight as the fond memories keep rolling in. 13 News reporter Andy Bernhardt joins us live in Barbersville. Andy, your memory with Woody, the time you met him, was when you were um, showing him and he was showing you, I guess, how to use that flamethrower. And everybody seems to have a story who encountered him. That is so true, Amanda. I mean, I feel like that's a pretty cool story. Not many people can say that Woody showed them how to use a flamethrower, but people are continuing to pour in at this monument you see right here behind me. It was built by the Woody Williams Foundation to honor Gold Star families, and now it's being used by residents to pay tribute to their local American hero, Woody Williams. Now today, residents are continuing to honor him by placing flags, wreaths, and flowers at this monument here. I've been speaking with multiple residents who came by to pay their respects, and they say they're heartbroken over the loss of Woody. Many who stopped by today were emotional as they shared their favorite moments with Woody. Woody, they say it's heartwarming to see the community come together to remember what a courageous and giving person he was. I think it's amazing. It like, truly shows that he's a pillar of the community and a, a great West Virginian and a great U.S. citizen. So, yeah, I, I don't think I've met a better person than Woody Williams. He was just a wonderful person and down to earth, and he never thought that he was special, but he was. Residents say it's not been easy saying goodbye to their beloved local hero, but they say they're grateful for everything that he has done for this community as well as our nation. And again, I've been speaking with multiple residents making their way through, and I think one of my favorite stories was from Lucian, who was in that video you saw earlier, and he says that he was talking to Woody, and they were having really good conversation, and he didn't even know it was Woody Williams, so you can imagine how starstruck he was when he found that out as a fellow veteran himself.